Hello, this is Brother Teacher, Grandmaster Stroud. I would like to take this opportunity to invite you to my annual Gin and Doe Martial Arts Open Championships on September 8th, 2018, here in Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh, the event will be open to all styles and systems of martial arts. It begins at 10 a.m. The doors open at 9 a.m. It begins at 10 and it ends approximately around 4 o'clock p.m. and that's on a Saturday. At this particular event you will see numerous schools from the local area of Cincinnati, Dayton, uh, Columbus, uh, Richmond, Indiana and so forth all competing under one house roof and you will see Kung Fu, you will see Kuk So Wan, you will see Taekwondo, Tung Sudo, and Karate in general, and you will see Jin and Do. Some of my students will be competing as well. So the uh, particular categories will be self-defense, that's one. Another category will be empty hands, forms, or kata, pumps, hung, if you will. Another one will be weapons, uh, weapons competition, and then we will also have point sparring at my particular event our point sparring uh, for, for under black belt that is is up to five points everything is worth one point every technique that is whether it's a kick or a hand technique or strike and black belt and above black belt to master that is uh, there are seven points accumulation to be determined the winner and then we will also have continuous sparring that is when you go a little bit harder you spar for approximately two minutes, the best of three. Three matches, uh, whoever wins the first fight is the winner. If the other person wins the uh, second fight, it is tied. So you must break that tie with the third fight, in other words. And then we will also have ground fighting. Some like to call it jujitsu, but whatever your particular dis discipline might be, it could be judo, it could be wrestling, it could be jujitsu proper, we will have ground fighting. The awards are first through third, and we have consolation prizes as well. Uh, we have children participating from the ages of five all the way up until the oldest adult, it doesn't matter. We have many divisions and beautiful awards. You may even see me do a self-defense seminar within this time frame. So, if you're in the Cincinnati area, if you live here specifically or if you're in the area uh, in two weeks approximately from the airing of this particular video I would love to see your face in the place and you on the floor if you are an instructor or a student and please instructors and masters and grandmasters and black belts if you come onto the tournament floor to judge to referee to help please wear your uniforms no street clothes no jeans, no shorts, none of that. We keep in the grain of traditionalism in my tournaments. Okay, so if you're Kung Fu, wear your Kung Fu attire. And if you're Karate, whatever that is, and Kuk So Wan and so on. But don't expect to come in an event to not pay the admission. There's nobody greater than the next person. I've seen this all too often. I'm sorry this is me being an instructor now and being a man talking to you. You have too many people that come to your events that want to get in free, but they don't want to help you in any capacity whatsoever. Those days are gone, especially at my events. I, as a grandmaster with almost 50 years in the martial arts, paid my way. I don't care whose tournament it is. I know the tournament promoter's job is to raise finances for his school or whatever his purpose or her purpose is. And that's what I'm there for and that's what I bring my students there for. Not for me to get in free. So I pay for my own admission. Even though people try to turn me down as far as me paying, I say no, I want to. That's the way it's supposed to be. That's respect and that's honor and that's loyalty to the arts. That's the way it's supposed to be. Not this, uh, let me see if I can slide in, or I, I want a discount on this particular fee because I'm Grandmaster Tutu. I don't care who you are. If you're a martial arts master, especially, you should know how this thing goes. You don't get something for nothing. I was never taught that. I was taught that you pay 
your way. I've done it all of my martial arts career and I'm not going to stop doing it now. So I expect anyone walking in the doors to pay their way and not be asking for a handout. I'm sorry, I had to say that, but I love you and you know I do. This is Brother Teacher. I hope to see you on September the 8th, 2018 at Evanston Recreation Center again. Be there early at 9 when the doors open. Pay your registration fee and fill out the application or the registration uh, form, I should say. And we're going to have a good time as we always do the Jenindo way. So long.